guys welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for coming back for another video today i'm sharing my very first what i got my kids for christmas this year and how i did this was i just went to target and grabbed three shoppers and had the kids circle what they want amir doesn't really understand how to circle things that he wants he was kind of just like flipping through and looking at them so i chose his gifts for him that i know he would like sultan went crazy she circled so many things and no i didn't get her every single thing that she wanted but majority of it i did because i did tell the kids this year they could get whatever they want. Ruby was definitely like, Sultan, you're circling unnecessary things. You don't need that. Only circle what you need or what you want. It seems like Ruby didn't get as many things. Well, she didn't circle as many things as Sultan did, obviously. Sultan went crazy. I feel like I'm making a disclaimer, but not really. Ruby got what she circled and I will get her a few more things just so it doesn't look like Sultan got the most. <laughs> I want to avoid that on Christmas day. Once I'm done filming this video, I'm going to head to Walgreens and probably Sam's Club to pick up a couple of more things and I still have to get the kids stocking stuffers so that's what I'm going to be doing after this video. This video is going up on the same day that you guys are seeing it. I'm going to edit it and get it up because I want to enjoy the Christmas festivities this weekend with my kids before the big day. I also have to wrap and all the other things that you have to do before Christmas. I asked you guys on Instagram if you wanted this video and vast majority of you guys said yes so here we are. First up is this dancing llama. Sultan really wanted this. It says, watch me dance on YouTube. I shake my booty and dance to three epic songs. It has a little try me, it has a little. Okay, girl. So that's what this does. And this was one of the things that she circled. So I picked this up for her. Amir will actually like this too. He loves anything that's animated. I thought this was adorable and I love llamas. So that's her first gift. Whoops. Next, she circled this Baby Alive Snip and Style Baby. I guess you can cut the hair. I hope not. I hope you can't actually cut it. Oh, trim my bangs when they grow. Okay. Mm, I don't know about this. I didn't read into it. I just got what they circled. Hopefully, the scissors are not real. Comes with a couple little bows and a brush. It comes with little kitty ears on the inside. That's super cute. Sultan has cut her own hair a couple of times. The other day I was cleaning up and I saw curls, just like, it wasn't shedded hair, it was actual curls. And I'm like, did you cut your hair, Sultan? And she was like, yeah, I was trying to fix a part in the front. And I was like, no, you can't do that. Don't cut your hair with scissors. So hopefully this will just be a fun little thing for her to do and not cut her hair again. Let's see what it says. My hair is getting so long. <laughs> Oh, okay. Oh, oh my goodness. That's really adorable. Next, I got her this Barbie Care Clinic. It looks like it's an ambulance. There's 20 plus accessories here on the inside. This is really cool. They also have a Barbie camper and a dollhouse. I wish I had this when I was a kid, honestly. Like, I would have loved this. I did get them some new Barbie dolls this year, and they do have some from last year, but they needed clothes, and I also got them. This is what she's the most excited about, this Ryan's Treasure toy box thing. She's really excited about this. I'm sure you guys know this little kid from YouTube. He's huge, especially with little kids. I'm excited to see what's in here, too. I love little, like, discovery-looking fun things, so... Amir's gonna love that also. Next, my girls love Roblox. They are always asking me to buy them Robux and it seems like it's not expensive. It's like $9 or like $9.99 for $800. But when they ask for it like every other day, it's like, girl, calm down. But um, yeah, they love Roblox. They play the game all the time. And I got these little figurines for Sultan. This one is a Roblox Celebrity Collection Series 2. None of these look familiar to me. I don't know. Sultan also loves My Little Pony, so I got her a couple of those. This one, I think that's Rainbow Dash. Yeah, that's Rainbow Dash. That's who she was for Halloween. This looks like Applejack. Yep, Applejack and Pinkie Pie. I got her a Made to Move Barbie doll. It's like a yoga doll. I don't think I've ever seen a yoga doll like this or a doll in active wear like this before, so I thought that was super cute. And she's got a bun. Sultan specifically said she wanted this one, so... That's the one that I got for her. Another Barbie doll with rainbow hair. Sultan loves anything rainbow or glittery or just girly. So I also got her this one. Looks like the doll comes with glitter. Oh, it's like a glitter comb to make her, oh, cute, to make her hair glittery. 
adorable. Her outfit is cute too. This is the last Barbie that I got for Sultan. She said she wanted the Barbie doll in the wheelchair, so I thought, why not? It's actually a good thing, so. And the little puffs, the little ponytail puffs are so adorable. I love this doll. And she also comes with a ramp so she can like get up to places. I thought that was really sweet that she wanted the doll with the wheelchair. <laughs> I've never seen a doll in a wheelchair before, but that's really awesome. I'm glad they're making Barbie dolls that are more diverse and realistic. Next, she got this Pictionary Air. It's a C on the screen. You can play it on your TV or on your phone. It says a hysterical new way to play the classic family game Pictionary. If you guys have never heard of that before, it's a really fun family game. So we'll have fun with this. We can all play together. Even though these are what Sultan chose, there are things that all the kids are most likely going to play with or that we can do together as a family. You guys been following me for a while. On Ruby's ninth birthday, I got her a Nintendo Switch, the one that comes with the two controllers. So they can obviously play together, but Sultan wanted her own Nintendo Switch. She wanted the yellow one, so I got this one for her. She loves to play games, so she's gonna really like this. She has her phone and her iPad that she plays games on, but this will be good for on the go when we're in the car or when we're in stores. And the Sultan is very girly. She likes dresses and bows and glitter and unicorns and all that. So I wasn't surprised when she chose this foot spa. <laughs> I've always wanted one of these as a kid and she is gonna have so much fun with this It comes with like it comes with nail polish and little bedazzle gems and the toe thing and the little pedicure flip-flops This is gonna be a lot of fun. Ruby is most likely gonna use this too Ruby got a um, spa set with a robe and some lotions and bubble bath for her birthday So they're gonna have little spa nights now probably with me on Sundays We can all oh this is eight and up well, she wanted it, so I got and it. The last two things that Sultan got were this little book bag. It's a rose gold one, and it has that sequence that you can push up and down, and it changes. She also wanted this. It's just like a little bag with a zipper on top. It feels like a little lamb. It's super cute, but girly, and my girl loves anything girly. Now, moving on to Amir. I got him this Melissa and Doug ice cream set and I have purchased this for the kids in the past but it got lost when we were moving so I got another one and he loves imaginative play. Amir really likes anything that's food related. At school they have a kitchen and like little food things and his teacher always sends me pictures of him playing in the kitchen or setting a table or doing something like that. He did open a few of his gifts already. I also got him a Melissa and Doug cash register thing you like put the coins in and then press it down and it comes out through the bottom the reason i let him open it up was because last week he was feeling really sick and i felt bad so i just wanted to give him something to cheer him up and it didn't really work he wasn't really interested but now he plays with it he's feeling better now and he plays with it so that's one gift that i let him open early and he also got a pirate ship and a um, food set. He got breakfast, lunch, dinner, and desserts. He likes anything that he can stack and the ice creams stack on top of each other. They're magnetic, so he's really gonna like this. Next, Emir loves to play dress up. So I got him a firefighter costume. This is also Melissa and Doug. This is gonna be so adorable. Recently they had a fire truck come to their school and they got to sit inside and got little fire hats and he Loved it. His teacher told me so I picked this one up for him. And I also got him the doctor dress up. He loves to play doctor or anything that's imaginative. He loves it. So he's really gonna like this. I really like Melissa and Doug for children like three and under because they're really good quality and they're non-toxic. And Amir is in school now. He does know how to count his color, shapes, letters, all of that. Um, so I got him this cute little wooden clock. The pieces also come out in their different shapes and colors and numbers. He's really gonna like this and Sultan can also use this too because she's in kindergarten now and she's learning how to tell the time. She's good at telling digital time, but I also wanted to have this classic clock so she can learn on here. Um, it says it's a sorting shape clock and it's for ages three and up. I got him this little fruit cutting set, also from Melissa and Doug. It's wooden, you put the pieces together and it comes with a little knife. Oh, it's not a real knife, it's a wooden safe for kids knife and you can just cut it down the middle and it makes that um, Velcro sound, so he'll love this. This I have purchased for the kids in the past, but the pieces just got lost or maybe I decluttered them with the teddy bears because we used to have so many stuffed animals. I just put them all in a bag one day and got rid of them so i repurchased this he loves to play with um food toys and make different things so i picked this up for him it comes with like red onions ketchup peanut butter and jelly it has a pita 
whole wheat bread, white bread. He's going to love this. I got him this VTech Drill and Learn toolbox. He's going to love this. It comes with little gears and things that he can screw inside. He loves to play with the drill. He's going to love this, you guys. We got a little toolbox. Oh, I'm so happy I have a boy now to buy gifts for. Next, I got him this Leapfrog Grow With Me ABC backpack. This is gonna be so good for when we're in stores or in the car. Like I said, he knows all of his letters already, but just to refresh and keep his mind um, occupied or keep him occupied. It also comes with this write and erase board where he can just write things or draw things and then you pull it down and it'll erase. Gonna love this, cannot wait to see him open. Can't wait to see him open all of his gifts. Amir also loves Duplo Legos. So I got him this airplane one. This is a set that he doesn't have. He has a train and like, park one and some other ones but i got him this one because he loves airplanes legos keep him busy for a really long time so really can't have enough then this is the last thing that i got for emir another duplo lego set this one's the mickey mouse clubhouse one he loves mickey mouse clubhouse and trains and legos so gonna love this last but not least ruby ruby just had her 10th birthday a couple of weeks ago so she did receive gifts on that day and have a party first she wanted this vtech smartwatch it says it's for ages four and up. I hope she likes this. She said she wanted the blue one. When I saw the package, I was like, this looks more like for a little kid, but if she doesn't like it, I could always return it and get her something else. Next is this Rainbow Surprise by Poopsie. Something about kids these days, they love surprise things, like anything that they can open up and there's something inside or like dig for it. And you guys know all the LOL stuff. I'm actually going to get her a couple of LOL surprise um, packages similar to this, but they're LOLs. I don't know exactly what's in here. It says 20 plus surprises. And this one, this one was kind of pricey. So hopefully she likes it. She'll like it. She loves things like this. So next she got this VTech karaoke machine and all the kids are gonna love this, especially Ruby and Sultan. They love to sing and dance. So she wanted this and I of course got it for her. I would have loved a karaoke machine when I was a kid too. I love to sing and dance. Um, I can't sing, but I like to sing. Really cool, it has a little stand and a microphone. That's adorable. They're gonna love this. I'm just gonna wrap these and put girls on it because it's not really for specific it's not for like one or the other and there's three packs so i can't say like two are for you and no i can't do that so this is just gonna go under the tree and i'll just label it girls it's some more barbie clothes like dresses and shoes some little accessories ruby also wanted this angelique star special edition not sure what she does, but she seemed really excited about it. Oh, it's from Shopkins. Oh, the little Shopkins are on the inside, yeah. So she wanted that, so I picked that up for her. She also wanted these sequins shoes. They look a little bit small, hopefully they fit her, but that's what she wanted, so. These are cute. Little sequins, warm and cozy footsies. She literally circled this book, Diary of a Wimpy Kid Wrecking Ball, so got that for her. Ruby loves to read, she has so many books, and this is a series that she really enjoys, so she put it on her Christmas list, so I got it. This is the other yoga Barbie doll that Ruby chose. They both wanted one, so I picked that up for her. Ruby loves Descendants 3. She loves Descendants, she loves the songs and the dances and all of that, so she really wanted this one. I wanted to get her the um, set with three girls, but they didn't have it. I guess it was too close to um, Christmas and they were all sold out. So I found this one on Amazon. She's gonna love this. She's wanted this for a while. The last thing that I got for Ruby is a bicycle. Ruby needed a new bike for a while now, but when I bought the little ones their bike, she said she didn't want a bike. She just wanted a scooter. Now she wants a bike. So I got her a bike this Christmas. She wanted a teal bike, but they didn't have one there. So hopefully the little mint in there is okay for her. She's gonna love it. Ruby's not picky. And I also got her a helmet, of course, because have to wear a helmet in Florida when riding a bike. I'm not sure if it's like that everywhere, but it should be. You guys are probably like, whoa, yeah, I set up all the toys so I could get a thumbnail picture, but that is it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed it, and I hope you all have a great holiday season. Stay safe and be with your families and just enjoy the moments because they're so special, especially while your kids are young. For those of you that have family members that are no longer with you, just know that you are in my thoughts and in my prayers, and I hope you guys have a great Christmas. Make sure you guys are following me on Instagram. I'll probably be updating on there the most. I am still vlogging and I plan to include the wrapping of these gifts in one of those videos, hopefully, because the kids are going to be home from school. So don't know when that's going to work out. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you all in my next video.